What's the numbers? Depending on the tuner you use, because people use different tuners. We got a Lars Fogger system, the T4 Turbo Dominic. That's what we're here to find out. We got a bike on the dyno. So the day has come. I know you guys have all been waiting to see uh, the numbers. What's the numbers? Um, we got everything for you. It's gonna give you a short little dyno run. Uh, sound test for you guys as well, so you guys can hear how sick and wicked this bike sounds, because it, it sounds like a beast. Um, Mike took the bike out before as well, and I mean, I'll, well, you can tell us what you thought about the first ride. <laughs> I haven't I haven't taken a ride on the bike whatsoever yet, so that that we're gonna be doing that today when I take it home. But he took it out and the um. uh, bike is fast. Um, it's smooth. It's it's really snappy. The cam kicks in pretty early, and uh, yeah, the bike's pretty fast. But you're gonna have to ride it because I ride different bikes every day. That's right. <laughs> All right, yeah, I'm, I'm super excited to get on this thing, man. Um, it's gonna be a thrill. Yeah. So answers everyone's question. Show them what's the numbers right here real quick. We got 138 horsepower and 152, well, almost, well, yeah, 152 foot pounds of torque. Those are corrected numbers. Because we, we use the real numbers here. Yeah. Not the fake numbers. If we want to look at fake numbers, I'll show you fake numbers. Well, not fake numbers, STD. but it's... STD numbers are more like a, uh, wow. at the time, a raw horsepower number to the wheel. So uh, it's an, so that would be 141.8, 156.9. So like 142, 140, and 157. Wow. It's insane. Yeah. We got a little bit of tweaking to do, it looks like. The air fuel's from 4,000 up. We're just gonna tweak that up a little bit and see if we can get a couple more points out of it. Sick. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm super, super happy with this because, Jesus, 152 is insane. Mm -hmm. um, now, remember, Harley advertised this at, like... Yeah, like, I, that's what I was going to look at right now. I think it was, like, 120-something horse and then 130 torque. 134, I think it was. Yeah, so buying this kit... Um, and remind you, uh, if you're using the Screaming Eagle tuner, which we didn't use, and if you're using the Screaming Eagle cam, which we didn't use, I kept the cam, the 43 Sakurama cam that was in here before. Uh, but if you use all the Harley components, you're gonna be at 135 foot-pounds of torque and 124 horsepower. We got 138 horsepower and 
152, basically almost 153 foot pounds of torque, which is an immense, like. So what I did notice on that pull, uh, I was watching the gauges here, mm -hmm. and it seems like the injectors might be a little small because we were almost, we were in the 90s on the duty cycle when it hit the higher RPM. So on our next, uh, whatever we do next, we might, well, I may bump those up to six ones. Because okay. remember, we put everything from the kit, came with five fives. I, I think we're gonna have to bump the injectors up. That's fine. Um, I mean, the, the clutch right now is also holding up fine, but we're, we're gonna be switching that as well. So that might be a project for next month. Um, so we're, we're gonna be looking at some stuff and see what, uh, what clutch we put in there. It would change out the fuel injectors. Um, we do that both at the same time. Yeah. And then uh, we can do some more runs on it. Yeah, that should be, should be good, man. I'm super excited for this. I just can't wait to get on the, uh, on the bike. Um, yeah. You got a lot to take it home. You're right. You can't ride it. right. Um, if you're running this cam or if you're running a similar kit, guys, I want, I want everybody kind of to share the numbers. I mean, if you want to share your numbers, some people don't like sharing the numbers, but um, yeah, let me know what kind of setup you got. Uh, what are you running? It's got a Maus Bogger system and a T4 Turbo Dominic. You see an AIC. Depending on the tuner you use, because people use different tuners, um, you know, your, the numbers can vary depending on the cam. And dyno as well, so, and then temperature, wherever you take it, I, it's, 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 so oh, right now. okay. We're dealing with a humidity level of 36%. Okay, which is not bad. Um, yeah, everything takes a, takes a little factor in everything, but I'm super happy with these numbers. I can't wait to get on the bike. And yeah, that's it. That's all I can say. If you're in the local area, you want to get some work done like this, make sure to stop by the Tour Custom Cycle Shop. Hit up Mike, all his information is gonna be down below in the description box. You guys can hit him up to have my sent you. And if you want your bike to sound and be a beast like this one right here, follow these steps. Anyways, that's gonna be it. Those are the numbers. Hope you guys are happy. Enjoy your weekend. We got another video coming within a few days. I'm gonna catch you guys on the next one. Like always, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.